Jesus was led by the Spirit into the wilderness. He fasted for 40 days and 40 nights. Matthew chapter 4 verses 1 to 2 40 days in desert Jesus fasted and prayed. Dear brothers and sisters, the season of Lent calls us introspect and to analyze our relationship with God and neighbor and with ourselves. My dear brothers and sisters, the 40 days has a biblical meaning. 40 days and 40 years which is specified in Bible is a period of test and trial. The Old Testament, the travel of Israelites to the promised land, setting them free from slavery from Egyptians and making them to walk with the Lord in the wilderness for 40 years. This trial was to make them to have the promised land. As they traveled, they also increased their trust in God. They grew strong and people realized that they belonged to Holy God. Because these people in earlier times were stiff-necked and also were stubborn. But this 40 years of their experience made them to walk closer to God. As Exodus chapter 14 verses 14 says, that I will fight for you. Likewise, God was there in all their ways, fight for them. So this Lenten season calls each and every one of us to increase our faith, hope and love in Jesus and to live a harmonizing life with God and neighbors. This season of fasting and prayer and almsgiving is for our renewal. Prayer, fasting and almsgiving are simple words but with great inner meaning. It calls us for the renewal of our sins and to ask God for repentance and forgiveness for our life. As Psalm 51 verses 2 says, Cleanse me from my sin. St. Ambrose of Milan would say, Fasting is food for the soul, nourishment for the spirit. And this is done through prayer and almsgiving. We fast a kind of self-mortification. As we fast, we pray. As we pray, we also start loving others. And that love is given to God and neighbor. God is also asking us in this season of Lent to fast from greed, jealousy, lust, avarice, enmity, hatred, sloth and what not. The list goes on. Whatever it is not of God, we are asked to fast and ask God's repentance and forgiveness and to pray as the psalmist prays chapter 51 verses 10 create in me a pure heart O God and we are called to give that blessing to others in whatever ways that is possible because God gave His only Son to us so that we are redeemed and we are given a life according to His plans and purpose. 
So my dear brothers and sisters, let this Lenten season be a meaningful season for us. Walking closer with God, knowing His plans and purpose, and to implement it the, for the coming days of our life. Let this season of Lent be a great blessing for everyone. God bless you all.